in terms of your sexual taste, is it like ordering off a menu? Or or, or not ordering off a menu, uh, what kind of food do I want tonight? Like Thai or Japanese or German or like, yeah. or going on Pornhub and being like, old late, I like ladies. Sure. So then I, within ladies, I go, I don't know. Maybe let's see if that's anything. It's like, it's more like blindly reaching my hand into a bucket and whatever I pull out. <laughs> I'm like, I'll eat that. <laughs> but is it that random? Does it feel that random? No. It, w w like, whatever it is that will turn me on, it, it changes. It's like, uh, you know, uh, for a long time it was a feet. And then I'm like, no, I don't care about feet or just being smothered by your girls. It, it really, it depends on the moment and the day what I'm gonna look for. I mean, there's certain things that like would never turn me on, um, you know, and the, the typical stuff that doesn't turn most right. sane people on. Piss, uh, sorry. Well, you know, I mean. <laughs> let's not be crazy. Yeah, let's not be crazy. I mean, it's, it's a fetish, it's a beverage, it's, it's anything you want it to be. Okay, so I mean, this, I'm sort of jumping around That's here because there's a bunch of the, uh, the well, the first, the first block is sex addiction, so we'll just throw that sure. up and we'll, we'll, we'll place all that under here. Within a marriage, you'll go through a cycle of what turns you on, however long, a week, a month, a year, whatever. Can Nikki provide all this? Or is the understanding like, sometimes I, I like what you offer and other times I need to leave or, or she tries to accommodate what you're into she's pretty open um but she's also pretty traditional like she's very very like she's a very literal person she's not into role play or dirty talk she's just let's, let's get to it she's tactile dirty talk is so embarrassing i'm i like it because i'm pretty good at it and i'm a great dirty texter uh but i can see it being embarrassing if someone's not comfortable I, it's just with not it. i just find the writing bad yeah some of it can it's be. all like guys all say the same thing and women all say the same yeah, thing. Yeah, like, hey, experience. hey, you're so wet. I mean, that's yeah, shit. Yeah, or like, are you my whole, just all this, like, it's just like, it's hacky. If you mean it. Like, if you, t to me, a person meaning it is very important. Army like, Hammer. Uh, Army Hammer, you know what? That's a typical, <laughs> I look at that as such a not a big deal. Like, as long as he didn't, I don't know if he forced that woman or not. It's like that documentary about the cop who wanted to eat Gilbert, people. Gilbert, uh, whatever his name was. Yeah, a I friend? knew one of the girls in, in that porn. Of course you did. I knew uh, who I love. Her name is Pepper Kester. She's one of the <laughs> sexiest women in history. She would do a lot of that, like, cannibal porn or whatever. Yeah. Um, and he, It's like, like, can you say, I want to eat you? Sure. Like, what's wrong? I, I, even with Army Hammer... Obviously, once you're into physical, non-consensual physical harm, then I go, oh, yeah, that you can't do that. But texting. If he's into, if it's, I, I don't know if it's non-consensual or if she's just a jilted ex who hates him. I don't know. Right. I don't know. I know. But the texting didn't, was nothing. It was like, it's pure dom sub relationship. Yeah. It's, and to, for people to pretend that they don't understand that, yeah. how could anyone like yeah. that? How could any guy want his dick stepped on? But there is an entire cottage industry of women who are paying their rent because By they the way, kick guys in the balls. Have you ever, in there's a book called Everybody Lies, and they looked up the stats on what women search for and what men search for in terms of rough sex on Pornhub. And rough sex, the searches from women were 24%, and the searches for men were 6%. So in that case, women are significantly more into it than men are. Anyway, yeah. it's like, and then people going like, "What the pearl clutching up? Like what? Yeah, they're lying. It's just dishonest. I, yeah. I don't believe it, and that's why I, I'm not upset by it. But they're lying. Like yeah. the whole like oh, what he wrote, what he wrote is not a fetish of mine. I don't understand it. But reading the language of it, I know exactly the nature of that relationship because I've had that relationship with women where I've been dominant and I've also been I'm more submissive. I've had women saying such humiliating things about wanting to fuck other the guys in front of me how i wasn't enough how i would have to you know like all of these things that you think wouldn't turn a person on but what turned me on was that she liked it and it's like the fact that she's so dirty and sharing this intimate private filthy stuff uh but and that's also the thing of like you can't explain that to people who are want to act like it's like all right th there's seven dynamics here and they're all very subtle. And you can lie and say it's all disgusting. And sure. Ever, but like, you're being dishonest about sexuality. You know, it's helpful. Hey, did you like that? Did you like that? Yeah, did you like it though? You want more? Don't want to work? Would rather watch videos of me grab assing with people? First of all, go up here to subscribe. And then go up here to uh, watch more clips. This is like when the weatherman says that there's a high pressure system coming in. I'm not really used to the green screen.